Akita, our lovely white German Shepherd, is following us everywhere. She's just the most amazing dog. And we were thinking we would like to make something out of all her fur. She is shedding a lot. So every autumn we always end up with this bag full of her lovely white fur. Since we have sheep, I also have a spinning wheel. And I tried to make these mittens some years ago. Uh, with her fur that made very good thread. But now I would like to try a different challenge and make a hand spindle from scratch. Just to see how easy it is and uh, yeah. if it is possible to do this without having all this spinning gear like I have. For the fun of it, I will just try to make two at the same time. I have made this notch in the branch so that the weight under the thread will be as much in the middle as possible. Here's the second one. They are not perfect, but I'm sure they will work out just fine. I usually use these wool cups and sheep wool to separate and straighten the wool fibers before spinning, but now I want to try if it is okay just to use normal dog brushes. Even though they are a bit smaller, I think uh, they will do the trick too.
they aren't working as good and fast as the regular wool brushes, but they are working for sure. So it's time to try uh, my new hand spindlers. That worked quite well. So I will try the first one. It's a bit wobbly. I'm getting the hang of it. It is actually quite easy. I don't quite have the patience for the small dog brushes. But I will spin all the yarn on the handmade uh, hand spindles. <laughs> Now I think both of them are equally good to work with. Hey, 
Here are the results from one full hand spindle. And voila, it is finished. If you enjoyed this video, please don't hesitate to follow our YouTube channel at Wild and Woolly. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there in YouTube land. Bye!